Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome back, friends. Welcome back to another video lecture by Kami Microbiologist. Today, in this video lecture, we are going to talk about palcum lasteria agar medium. So, this palcum means P A L C A M. It stands for polymaxine acrylphilvine lithium chloride ceftazamide esculine minithor. Okay. Now, this media is actually a highly selective media. We can also say that it is, this is differential media. But uh, when, let's suppose, the, this media contains uh, glucose or starch or dextrose. So, when these starch or dextrose are utilized or uh, fermented, so then we get other types of the bacterial colony. But if it is not fermented, so then Listeria colony will be easily grown in this media. Okay. Now that's why we can say it is a highly selective media for uh, which we can specially use for the exterior monosaturgene isolation. Now let's talk about the composition of this media. This media contains peptone, starch, escoline, distal water, agar, yeast extract, ferric ammonium citrate, minithol, phenol, phenol red, lithium chloride, sodium chloride, dextrose. These are all the most important ingredient uh, amount which we need in one liter let's talk that uh, what are the most important uh, uses of this ingredient means the principle of this media as this media contain lithium chloride septazamide polymexin b acryflavine hydrochloride now the presence of this most important ingredient it will stop or inhibit the growth of uh, most gram positive as well as gram negative bacteria but it will just allow the growth of listeria monocytogenes bacteria that's why we can say this selective media now the presence of vegetable peptone will provide nitrogen that is specially needed or and other nutrients as well that is needed for the growth of listeria monocytogenes we have starch which is detoxifying the metabolic product and then we have sodium chloride that can maintain the osmotic balance in the media then we have uh, escoline which is converted into escolitine and dextrose now the presence of these two things will actually you know react with ferric citrate now when these are reacting so then what we get we get a brownish black precipitate around the colonies it is due to this uh, escoline then we have minitol as well as phenol red which are acting as a pH indicator so when acid is produced the pH uh, is dropped and we get other colony mostly elastera monocytogenes are not fermented uh, the dextrose or uh, uh, you know the other lactose medium so that's why it can uh, uh, we can say that it have the same colonies uh, blackish brownish colonies elastera monocytogenes mostly hydrolyze escoline which means they are black hollow round colonies but it does not ferment them in toll that's why we can say the pH indicator will be not dropped but remember guys we have other bacteria like enterococcus streptococcus that can ferment them in toll and due to this way the media of the color which are red will be changed into yellow due to the uh, you know utilization of minitor now how we can prepare this media so again we need a 35 gram of list uh, palcum listeria agar and will dissolve it into one liter then we will heat and boil it for one minute to completely dissolve the media then we will have to clave it at 1.1 degree celsius for 15 minutes after that we will put this media into sterilized petri plate at a 50 degree celsius then we will streak the bacterial colony using a step septic technique after that we will you know incubate this plates at 37 degree celsius for 24 hours now these are the bacterial colonies as you can see using this media so mostly Listeria monocytogen showing a good growth on this media and uh, it mostly have gray green colonies uh, with circle dark brown hollows uh, in a black medium as you can see so these are the uh, dark hollow as you can see and uh, mostly gray brown or uh, good uh, gray green colonies if you see it live so you will found a gray green colonies so this is all about the uh, palcum listeria monocytogenes uh, listeria agar i hope you guys get idea about that thanks for watching